Yeah, it's uh, another another case of a person who's using an underrepresented character to like the best of their ability. So you, I think a lot of the matches is gonna be uh, Exact figuring out how the heck Lucario plays in neutral mm -hmm. and figuring out what he's supposed to do from there. All right, well let's see. Starting off game one. Immediately throws the splat bomb. I think he's just trying to see how uh, yeah. Sue would react. Yeah, how to does it. Sue react to the splat bomb? And if he does anything like predictable, like as far as like a defensive option goes, goes th from there to get like a free grab. Yeah. But uh, Sue's shown that he's really good at moving around with Lucario, not necessarily falling into these like predictable but defensive uh, patterns for the most part. Mm -hmm. Already getting that big damage though so far, with a quick up throw combo. Yeah, this is actually an interesting matchup for a reason. Uh, outside of Roller, Inkling doesn't have that many easy ways to kill Lucario, so this might be an opportunity for Lucario to farm free aura and yeah. kill really early. Well, he was looking for it, but he drifted back away. Lucario is more floaty, so he stays in directional air dot drift longer, so he can definitely do oh, that. That beer versus aura, a snipe to catch the jump into back air attempt, that was clean from, uh, from mm -hmm. Sue. I'd love to see that again. Nice. Oh. Harry thought he would cross up his shield, but doesn't get the forward smash. Yeah. Okay. Oh, oh my, there's the yeah. double team. <laughs> Finally gonna get that one on stream. I saw him doing going for that a lot against Elegant getting punished for it, but seeing that Exact's gonna press a lot of buttons, but there is the berry into the F smash, mm -hmm. catching him rolling away there. Yep. Immediately even up the game, taking no percent there, but there's the Nair grab, up throw, up air. Free 19% from Lucario. Yeah, overall, BZ2 doing relatively about the same, going pretty even. A different flow than from the, the Abadango set, but I feel like that was because Abadango plays the character, so yeah. I think Itsu has to kind of play a little bit differently and still gather some data. Yeah. Yeah, though, I definitely feel like uh, as far as the damage output is going to go, it, it's kind of in Lucario's favor because sure, you'll eat all these hits, but getting the kill outside of Roller, like I said, is really rough, and f farming aura is really strong for Lucario. Yeah. But up throw up air. Oh, double teams the splat bomb. Really, really smart idea there to go for that. Yeah. Got clipped by the force palm before he could really get the roller. Oh, another opportunity here, though. Puts him off stage. Got the warrior spear charges a little bit. Jumps out of it to get to the ledge. No jabs. Just able to jump out just fine. You definitely got to watch out for that warrior spear. It's incredibly powerful projectile. And Excess is jumping around to avoid getting sniped by it. Almost. Oh, nice. I th he thought he could get the grab, but x was able to dash away in time. Oh, that was really scary. Yeah, very rough. He actually canceled the Aorus here, charging into like an up smash, and x would have landed right in his face, but barely avoids the down smash at the ledge. Yeah. Okay. So we're just playing safe here. Knows that he's very scary. Look at his aura. So powerful right now. And now this is actually the best position. He has a stock lead and some aura as well, so he can kill really early, or at least do at it percent. Okay. All right, there we go. Up throw. Will he be able to get up here? No, no. he's just going to air dodge through it. Yeah, Lucario with the stock lead and already got the aura stacked on. Yeah. Really, really one of the scariest characters to fight in this game. A nice tech chase into the down air aura sphere. Big damage. 56 is really scary. Yeah, at this point, Sue's kind of steamrolling him. But this is the struggle that Exact can't find the kill. I mean, he, he fell for roller once, but can't fall for it again. That's yeah. the, the scary part. Yeah, if he uh, does an unsafe roller on his shield, he can potentially die to like a force palm. The side B, that is. Yeah, how's he going to land the kill? I mean, the way Sue's being so mobile and having that force palm threat. Ooh, oh, never mind. He jumps <laughs> into his face. All right, we'll take it. Yeah. He's just saying, okay, stop with the with the mumble jumble. Let's just go and go for a fourth smash. Sometimes you got to play Ratchet. And it works, too, because another thing about Sue is... Uh, when he knows he has aura and the opponent's kind of scared, he actually plays a little bit more aggressive. Mm -hmm. He kind of gets rewarded for playing aggressive when he has aura. Yeah. Got a little bit of damage here. Exax uh, really has the opportunity to bring this back, though. There we go. Gets that grab. Extension on the platform. Not quite. Right, watch the aura sphere. Nice. Just baiting him to stay in shield. I thought he was just going to run up and side B him while he's just holding yeah. shield like that. I guess not quite yet. Yeah, I think he's trying to see how X-Ax reacts. I think he was expecting a jump out of shield or something. Not quite finding it either. Oh, that was really risky. <laughs> nice pivot out from X-Ax. Up throw into the near. 
Send him to the corner of the stage. Oh, not going to find his back here. Sent, gets sent to the other side. Oh, great timing on that neutral getup. Oh, my goodness. What a punish. Exact's going first. The Exact kind of smiling on that. <laughs> going for the rogue uh, roller there. I think I think you have all the time in the world to react with uh, double team on that. That's crazy. I think Exax was legit thinking like he, as he was doing the roller, it's like, oh shoot, he's actually just gonna stand there. This is my yeah. opportunity, and then he got double teamed. Yeah, it, that's actually a free punish because you're stuck in the roller animation when he does double team, so it, he's guaranteed to get hit by it. Yeah, man, talk about he was already struggling to kill before, right? Mm -hmm. Now he has to worry about his main kill setup getting double teamed, but uh, now we're getting Joker here. Okay, I, I like it. sue has been doing that a lot at the, uh, the, kick the kickoff event on Friday. Mm -hmm. like he would win the first game with Lucario pretty like solidly, and then he'll just switch off to Joker to like throw off anything they, they might have learned. Yeah. And uh, his Joker is really, really good. Like next to Leo, he's probably the next best Joker I've seen so far in this game. Mm -hmm. I think a lot of it has to do with how good he is at using take aim. Like just yeah. the bullets and the way they can stuff recoveries. You can definitely do that against a character like Inkling, like right there. Yeah. And uh, yeah, having an opportunity to actually edge guard in his recovery is not a lot of things that not something that a lot of characters in this game can say. Yeah, and it's from a safe distance too because he's just approaching it from the top, so not, there's not really a chance of being reversal in the next situation as well. Nice use of the guns, as you were saying, just seeing him off stage. Now he has Arsene. Oh my goodness, he's not letting him breathe on the ledge. Every time he thinks he's safe, he's just shooting him on the ledge. There's the up Ooh. smash, huge range, especially when he has Arsene mm -hmm. above him. You don't want to jump on this character. Yeah. Nice bullets into the downer. Like, dang, Sue's going crazy aggressive when he has Arson, dude. Yeah, one more opportunity right there. Nice Aegon, getting all the percent he needs. At like that, it's kind of like a poison effect when mm -hmm. you get hit by that. Yeah. It just adds up damage over time. And Sue barely oh. being hit. Oh, I think he. No, no, okay, no, no he, he did. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> The guy hey. was from the depths. Mm -hmm. I thought he may have uh, clipped the jump there when he was so far low, but not quite yet. I like how he just casually shoots the gun. Like, he only does 1%, but he just adds up that little percent off stage while, like, he gets to come back for free pretty much. Yeah. And the setup, too, I think it's not, not just the bullets, but the fear of, like, afterwards, like, he can land with, like, a different Ooh. attack. Oh, oof. Free punish. I think Exax landed into the stage with up B. Wow. Sue, are you working on an, uh, Three stock lead right now, but there's yeah. the four there. Caught the double jump. Yeah, it can't come back. Oh, oh what? No. He got Arsene. Arsene came <laughs> at the perfect time. He actually couldn't come back otherwise. Oh my god. Oh my god, that was so smart. That was so good for Sue. And he got the double egg on now. Yeah. Potentially working on a three stock if he plays his cards right. Arsene can definitely melt stocks away mm -hmm. in the blink of an eye. There's the spy bomb. No, use the side up invincibility of the up B to get past it. That was really smart from Sue. Man, down arrow with, uh, with Arsene is so safe on shield. Yeah. Okay, Arsene is finally gone, but still, it's our time for Exax to try and take the stock. Like we said, looking at a potential three stock, but finally gets the back air. We'll be able to seal out that stock. Yeah, it's good to get the uh, stock off a of Joker before he gets the Arsene meter back. Because mm -hmm. when you uh, take off his stock, it resets back to zero. Still, Sue looking really comfortable in neutral here. Again, really smooth positioning of the guns, just crossing up shield really well. Okay. Yeah, looking like in a bad position right here. Nice. That's another four tilt. I like what Exax did. He did like straight into the stage so that uh, it would be harder for take aim to be able to connect properly. And he's mixing nice. up his timing too so that the bullets don't have enough time to catch him. Still really solid lead for uh, Sue right now. Exax not really getting anything too crazy. Okay, nice. But there's the rebel star. <laughs> he still attacks him. It, it was Arsene's here to play now. Yeah, you, you gotta wait until the the blue fire goes away completely, and then you still got enough time. So you, yeah. you, people kind of forget that rebel's guard you oh. can hold for so long. Great tetra card from the ledge. Sue working on getting the stock off 170 percent. Pretty much sneeze on him with Arsene right now, and he'll get the stock. Yeah, he just needs like one, I, oh. even a fair or anything actually, like any type of aerial oh I think will work. There's a macarena card. I, I actually don't know. Macaron card. Macaron card. I think it's <laughs> <was, laughs> <it's> a macaroni <laughs> card. <laughs> <laughs> you know, some of those words in Persona I don't actually read. I'm just like macaron is something something. But here we go. Yeah, like we said, uh, even with regular Joker, I think just like one fair off stage or anything like that Ooh. will be able to work. Okay, raw smash attack in his face. Why not? He has to do anything to get the stock at this point. But still, <laughs> he says such a high percent. This added percent from the AHA, 210 plus. Makes it back because of the splatter shot. Opportunity for Exax. I mean, he's back in neutral, but he's got to mess up basically no times at all. 
Yeah, like down air or something. That's like the main way I see him potentially winning this. Dash attack, not, oh, never mind. He is dead. Damn, yeah, that is it, enough. I guess it kills at like 220 or something. Yeah, that was pretty crazy. Man, that's such a strong pocket character to have. Like, you're an amazing Lucario, and there's not that many Lucarios, so you already have an advantage over most people. But then if they ever figure out your Lucario, you have an amazing Joker mm -hmm. in the back pocket. Right. Sue's uh, character pool is looking really good for him. Switching back to the to the Lucario this time. All right, let's see. PS2. Going back to seat. Um, it might be might be stage specific because yeah. he wins Lucario on this stage too. Exactly. Yeah, I don't know. I think he liked FD for Joker just because he has so much space to just move move around. Mm -hmm. You know. Yeah, you can do those two air combos without any like distractions from the platforms. Yeah. Stuff like that. We'll or see, though. Mm -hmm. One game away from top eight. Sue looking to make his name for himself again, getting another top eight in the overseas tournament. All right, there nice we go. Up there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I really want to see how Exxon is going to get the kill now. We saw in the previous match where he got double teamed for trying to use Roller. I still think that's a really good option for Sue to throw out if Exxon is too greedy for the kill. Right. Oh. Both of these two... They're tagging on the damage, but it looks like neither of them are really figuring out how to close out the stock quite yet. x still got an opportunity to try and bring this back around. Yeah, I think, though, even if they both struggle to get the stocks, it works out in Lucario's favor. He passively is just getting stronger mm -hmm. by, you know, t with each hit he takes. Oh, there's a zoom in effect. Yeah, That's there it so is. Cool. <laughs> yeah. All right, there it is. Mm -hmm. yeah, he, yeah, I think you need, like, an X amount of aura to be able to get the zoom in effect. There we go. Finally able to find nice. it. I love the cinematic finishes in this game. Really yeah. cool thing that they added to uh, Smash Ultimate. Mm -hmm. So, Sue working with the stock lead and already have the aura stacked on too, so his attacks are going to be hitting a little bit harder. But there's the roller. That'll do it. Yeah, nice. that's enough to do it, yeah. Caught his landing pretty well. Yusu wasn't ready to react with the double team that time. Mm -hmm. And didn't take any percent, so XX did a really good job of evening things up. Yeah. Well, I mean, he barely pulled it out at all, so I think he was thinking, oh, he's probably just not going to do roller anymore, and then brought it out the right time. Yeah. He also has to watch the spot bomb too, because he was also getting double teams on that as well. And Exus likes to use that move in neutral quite a bit. Okay, back into the grab. Try to get another one. Nice, calls up the jump. He got the spot bomb on the ledge. Another free grab. Down throw, forward air, huge percent opponents. And that's the down smash to catch the up beat. Exus doing a really good job of paying him to the other side of the stage. Took up so much percent, but not getting the stock. And that might come to haunt him with all the aura that he has now. Okay. Nope, not able to punish the bounce on that up B, but still gets the up throw. Waits on the air dodge. Nice, gets the forward. XX playing it on point right now. Okay. Yeah. Just got to figure out how to get back to stage. There we go. Man, this feels completely even. Yeah. <laughs> just oh, just by looking at percents, yeah. Lucario is almost max aura here. Or max rage as well. Yeah. There we go. Okay. Back throw. So not quite enough to do it. Oh, goes right past the down smash. Yeah. XX got to be careful here. I was gonna land. He has the aura spear caught him, and now he's at kill percent. Oh, he's oh, been at goodness. kill percent. <laughs> All right, let's see. How does he get the kill here? He's gotta find the less trap. Oh, so that scary. pressure with oh, the he aura caught spear him dancing on him. Wow, the fear versus aura spear just pressuring him with his movement, and now yeah. he has a stock lead with the aura stacked on just to, just for added measure. Yeah, that was so oh, good. Oh, but there's okay. the bomb. Yeah, caught the ledge jump. Exact taking only 10 percent, keeping it even. He wants to get this game to stay alive in this tournament just yeah. to bring it to a reverse 3-0 position but Sue only needing one more stock to move on to the top 8 loser's side alright what's the opportunity going to be oh it actually gets a trip with the back air that actually works out so well for XX there's a double team on the splat bomb it's a free hit for Sue gotcha. applying more R sphere pressure there we go gets that grab out of it Exx right, trying to find a way to open up Sue right here. He's just playing safely. He's charging the free aura. Nice. Gets the down arrow. Oh, great okay. tech chase. What's he going to do on this one? Doesn't catch him. It's Barry. Uh, get him yeah. out of Barry, though. Mm -hmm. He canceled it uh, a little bit too late. Actually, it looks like Exx in general doesn't really jump cancel his rollers. He usually just cancels it with B. It's a very interesting uh, decision because, like, Chag, for example, he always cancels with jump. Yeah, and so you get follow-ups if they uh, follow the, the, roser, or the yeah. roller berry animation. Mm -hmm. A okay. throw? That does it. Yeah, that'll do it. Exax taking a game there, bringing it back really far. Sorry, you guys, I see our face for a second. Yep. <laughs> but, uh, you know, production.
Mm -hmm. All right, XX staying alive here, trying to bring the reverse 3 0 dream to get in the top eight loser side. That would be a really big uh, statement for him to, to do well in his first big so called tournament yeah. since moving here. Oh, we're but moving back to the side. Joker, yeah. Are we back on MD? I didn't see the stage. The Neither did I. I was too distracted by my beautiful face, obviously. Okay, okay. Now he's trying it on PS2 this time. All right, let's see. Yeah, the Joker definitely looks really strong in the FD match. Let's see if he can actually close it out right now. Mm -hmm. Or is XX going to be able to bring us to a game five? Mm -hmm. XX has been pretty clutch so far. Like, even in the Abadango set, well, he, he normally starts uh, behind, but then he just finds a way to, you know, bring it all the way back. Yeah. Not going to be able to find anything there. Interesting that he opted for Roller that early percent, too, because he'll be able to mash out pretty yeah. pretty significantly early. Yeah, and even then, he still doesn't go for, like, their mash out follow-up. Mm -hmm. Okay. He's actually trying to maintain stage control, but gets sent off stage. Arsene's available. Oh, and this is where things get scary. Look at that Arsene back there, seeing him super far off the stage. I'm looking for, like, a dare, an up smash, like a pivot forward smash, something like that. Oh, almost caught the tech roll in with the forward smash. Is it back okay. here again? Oh, nice. Nice uh, job from Exile stalling his recovery to avoid the guns. Ooh. Ooh, gets hit by the second hit. Nice. Tech chase caught him missing a tech on the platform. He sneaks in the up smash. Really good awareness from Sue. Yeah, and what did he set up that with? Take aim. <laughs> yeah, his guns is amazing. But there's the roller into the up smash. No percent taken. Exax immediately evening up the stocks. He really is good at just shutting out his opponent's momentum when they get the stock lead. Mm -hmm. Oh, up tilt doesn't quite get the finishing hit on it, so can't finish it off. Oh! Whoa! Okay, Joker's up B goes really far as he makes it back, but sniping the jumps out does get the grappling hook out in time, though. You gotta be careful. Exax getting a few opportunities to take an early stock off stage. Mm -hmm. Okay. Right. Up throw. Goes for the forward air. And yeah, he's just uh, being, I mean, he's especially slippery with uh, Joker as well. I mean, he, yeah. we saw the same thing with Lucario, so it's kind of the same idea. But imagine if there's bullets yeah. going towards you at the same time while he's using that B movement. I also like how he's drifting uh, backwards and forwards with the AHA, just like making it even more safe. He really is utilizing all of uh, Joker's move set to a great effect. Mm -hmm. so That's that like comes in. Landing. Will he try to finish it off? Oh, try to go for a ledge trump. I I uh I would like to see Sue and when he has Arsene out to just hold Nair when uh, Exit goes for his up B. Mm -hmm. We saw the similar thing from Abadango's uh, Palatina when he got the Nair on Eklund's up B at the ledge. But there's a dash attack to catch the landing again. Arsene dash attack one of the strongest moves in the game. And now Sue one stock away from sending Exax out of the tournament and getting top eight. Joker looking to put in work here. I throw. Not the corner else. of the stage. Oh, nice. This AI right in his face, whip punching the whip grab from x -Ax. But there's the roller. Will he be able to get it in time? No, Doesn't not get enough. the kill, though, just, yeah. Just barely a little to percent to get that one. But there's a down there. Any little percent that he gets right now is really good for him. Since here he has a stock lead right now. Mm -hmm. Arsene's meter is relatively high as well. So he's going to be staying out for the play just a little bit longer. And now he has to deal with the Aegon, too. Just adding up all the percent over time. Just gotta be careful. Any good hit right now could potentially do it, but I think Exax recognizes that, so he's just camping out the rest of the Arsene Minter before things get too scary. There's a dash tag again. Sue working on this stock lead really well. There's the F smash from full screen, still gonna kill. Closing yeah. it out with the two stock 3 1. Exact space when I got hit by that, it was like, from cross stage? <laughs> oh, from cross stage. <laughs> yeah, see, uh, even without Arsene, Joker's smash attacks are really strong, but. Mm -hmm. 